Over the past year, AI has been the top topic of conversation. Uh, initially, it was a lot of what do we need to do to help secure our organizations uh, for AI, but it's very much evolved to how can I leverage AI in my security program? I'm Mandy Andrus, CISO at Elastic. I have always enjoyed traveling. I've traveled to Norway, Finland, Sweden, Germany, France, Estonia, Singapore, Australia, the UK, Greece, information security, cybersecurity. It's a space that I like because I'm always learning new things, always getting exposed to whether there's new technology, new people. The travel, it, it feels very similar and that's going to different countries, finding different cultures, different foods. For me, travel mindset is being adaptable. In today's world, you look at massive amounts of threat intelligence data. One of the key things that AI brings into it is you have real-time adaptation. So it's understanding, one, what's the threat landscape? What are those types of attacks? So giving us the knowledge, and this is the threat intelligence, and then moving into response. It's understanding both what response actions should you take and helping you get those steps and, and understanding that have been effective. There's a concept that has been bubbling up that I hear talked about more and more called anti-fragility. In the past, we were really focused on resilience. If something happens, how do we recover very quickly? Anti-fragility is focusing on how do we allow something to happen but still be able to move forward. With AI, we're able to learn new things and gain insights that could help us understand these are the things that we need to focus on, these are the things that we need to adjust. In security, you're sifting through massive amounts of data, of activity, and trying to make sense of what is happening, and is that something I should worry about, or is that something that's fine and I can ignore? But what I find about the power of what AI can bring into that is how do we both understand or better understand what's the normal or expected behavior in our environments and understand when there's something different. And being able to do that at scale and that's where combining search and combining AI together really brings that power to the forefront and it makes that much easier to use and much faster than what we have seen in the past. For so long, we've been very reactive. We see what threat actors are doing. We try to anticipate as best we can, but what Gen AI and, and newer technologies are bringing to the table uh, is I think we will now have the ability to better understand context of our environments and have better anticipation of what threat actors can do. I do think jobs will change. I do think there'll be an evolution, but it's much more about the collaboration and the working together with the technology and applying that to really helping organizations better understand their environments and what's happening in them. It's allowing the humans to focus on things that are just much more interesting and much more meaningful for them as individuals, as teams, and allow analysts to be much more creative and have much more fun in, in their jobs than I think what many of them feel today.